Devante is very energetic and he's always on the go and he loves to play with toys and cars. I found out when I had him in the hospital that day and I didn't know my son didn't have kidneys until he was on the bedside of me in an incubator and they told me that they had to take him straight to Children's. So I didn't even get a chance to hold him. Look at him now, that, the doctor yeah. told me that he wasn't gonna live past one hour and he's four now. So now we're just waiting for a call. They say he can get a kidney any day now. So we're, I'm just waiting on that call for them to tell me to bring him on in and he'll be ready. He will sure be ready. <laughs> Devante is awesome. Um, I have worked with him um, since I have been here. Um, he's one of our dialysis patients. So he's done home dialysis and in-center dialysis. So we've spent um, a lot of time with him over the past several years. He loves to make jokes and he loves to kind of um, mess around with some of the nurses in our clinic. Um, and so he really makes dialysis um, go a lot quicker because it's very entertaining whenever he's there. Mom was really excited. Um, and I think when we first referred him, he was kind of trying to understand a little bit more about what Make-A-Wish was all about. Um, and like from the start of when the volunteer reached out to talk to them, just getting to kind of like brainstorm ideas for his wish um, was awesome. During this pandemic, we don't really go nowhere to other people's houses. This is his happy place. This is his happy place and children's is his second home. Like we always down there. I think Make-A-Wish has been particularly creative um, during this time with wishes because a lot of our patients initially their wish is that they want to travel um, and so right now that's not really an option and so the room makeover is a perfect example of kind of coming up with something that not only can we do it right now but also it's something that during this time where it's so scary to kind of leave your house Having something that's in your home, like in your safe place, um, that is just for the patient is so cool. And it's such a kind of unique way to use a wish for a family that they're gonna get to, I mean, my patient is gonna get to use his room every single day. And so I think it's really cool that wishes are still happening. You know, it's, it's still an important thing that these families get to do.